All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another game analysis video, this time against the Charleston Battery in the USL. My name is Matt Sheldon, and I'm playing right back. So you can see right here, I'm the right back for St. Louis FC. So let's just get into the game. Oh, nope, I lied. There's going to be a little bit of pictures before the game starts. All right, so here's the very first couple seconds of the game against Charleston Battery. We're at home right now. Long ball into the corner, and then just kicked out. Right, so this is my first touch on the ball. The ball comes out wide to me. I realize I have time and space, so I'm going to turn up the field, and I see a defender coming, so I'm just going to play into my center mid in front of him so he can take it up the field and have some space. Ends up cutting it back, and we end up keeping the ball there. Ball gets switched out to me, so I just control it down with my thigh, push it out wide, and hit a curling ball into the far post, and we actually get on the end of it, and um, decent attempt here. So there's a little close-up. Just push the ball out wide, curl it around the defender to the far post, and then Mats Bierman almost is just a little bit too high for him. Center back gets the ball, and he plays it out wide to me. I have some time, but a defender coming in. As you can see right here, he's completely cutting off the line. So there's tons of space now in the center, so I'm going to take it in the center and just play in my center mid because he has tons of time and space. I want the ball right back right there, but I just don't get it. Get the ball played wide to me from my center mid. I take the guy on. Barely get around him, but I end up cutting it back, and then he kicks it out for a throw-in for us. Um, and then I think I'm just going to end up throwing it right into Tavo, into the corner, and he does a good job to turn down the line. Got the ball here. I'm going to play right into my center mid's feet. He's going to play right back to me, take a touch up the line, and then play it down the line, but we just don't keep the ball. And actually, it's fouled. Tavo gets fouled down the line right there. So here's a long ball. comes in. Over me, I got lots of time and space, so I'm just going to roll it back to my keeper so we can keep the ball on this one. As it playing back to me, again, I have lots of time. Looking up the field, just play back to my center back, and he plays back to the goalkeeper to keep the ball. Lots of time and space on the wing. I play it right back to my center mid. There's tons of time and space so we can hold on the ball. Tavo gets the ball now, and he plays me out wide. Again, I got some space. I have one guy on me, so I'm just going to cut the ball back, play right back to my center mid, and play right back to me, and one touch back to the center back. We really are focusing on just possession. As you see, I think we end up getting about 60% possession this game. So I'm going to cut it into the field, play it back down the line for, for my right mid, and I'm going to make a space, or I'm going to make a run into the space, but just don't get the ball back. Ball comes into my guy. I get up tight on him, but they call a foul. Probably get a little bit of push there. Probably a good call. I get the ball wide here. Now watch, look at the defender's body position again. He's cutting off the line, so I'm cutting it in. Another guy closes in on me, so I play it right back to my center mid. The center mid gets the ball, and he plays it into me. I get touches. I make a turn up the line. I pick up my head and play into my forward's feet, but he loses it right there. Center back as the ball plays me out wide with one touch. I'm just going to play it straight into my right mid's feet, and he's going to play back to the center mid so we can switch the point of attack. Ball comes into my outside mid so I'm going to run and I want to hit this in the air hard first time but I just do not make good contact at all with the ball but not terrible I get the ball back I got some time I'm going to do a little left footed chip up into my center mid who plays it back to the right mid ends up playing back to me lots of time on the ball and I end up just playing back to the keeper so we can switch it over to our left back here our left center back does a great ball over to me out on the wing Lots of time and space, so I'm driving my guy. I cut inwards. Um, I could play this guy right here, one of my forwards, but I don't, I don't know what the angle's like, but I didn't see it there, so I just played back to my center mid and loop back around to the right. Center back gets the ball, and he plays it out wide to the to me. I have lots of time and space. This is a terrible, terrible. I see my forward making a looping run out wide, and I completely mishit it, lofted it up. Not a good ball at all. My goalkeeper hits the ball up, and I just... Flick the ball down the line into my right mid, and then he's going to play me right back. I have some time and space, so I play it down the line into the forward, uh, but it's headed out for throwing. I'm pressuring my defense, and then I see this guy making an overlapping run right now, so instead of getting up tight, I back off a few steps, hold the ball, and then just kind of do a little bit of tight work to get my body in between the man and the ball, and I drew the foul there. And then just put the ball down, and quickly play to my center back so we can keep the ball, not just booting it. Lots of time here, so I'm playing it down into my forward. I make a run down the line. I probably should have stayed there. I, I didn't really, that run wasn't the best run. 
get the ball is playing to my center mid for him to switch the point of attack from a crowd inside over to the other side. Here, he's making a run down the line, and so it's not going to be good to attack down the line here, so I cut it inwards, come in, and then I play into the feet of my forward, but it's just not the best control there, but it's a good play. Get the ball out wide, lots of time and space, a little bit of a bad touch at first. Take the guy on with some pace, get around him, try to cross the ball in, and then earn a corner there. Could probably do a little bit of a move inwards at first to just give him off balance since he's a bigger guy, but next time. So I get the ball here. <laughs> exactly, next time do a little bit move, more of a move this time on the inside, whip an early cross in the near post, but it's headed out. Get the ball out. I let it roll out of bounds just because I had some pressure, and now I can throw it into my forward there. Um, plays me back, and I just play it right into my center mid, and he can turn with the ball. Here, this is my yellow card. I hit. I was a little bit late on the tackle. Hit all man there. Definitely was a yellow. Not very smart because this is at the very end of the first half, um, but they didn't end up doing anything with that uh, free kick. So anyway, here's the possession. Like I said, we have 63% possession to their 37%. That was one of our goals was to really maintain possession, but also with a purpose. And we have five shots and three on target, which is better than their two shots on target. Um, but decent half at first. So, But this is still 0-0. Zero, zero. So my right man gets the ball. I do an overlapping run, so I'm up. Look at this forward. He wants to into space down the line. So I'm going to slow up and just play exactly where he's motioning to, where he wants the ball. Kicked out for a uh, throw in. Play right and in, plays it right back to me. It's tight. I got two defenders. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll it over to my left and I'm going to play it right back to my center mid. Tries to chip it in, but it doesn't work out there. We get the ball played to me, do a little Cruyff turn and quickly play it down to my right mid. Does a good move and uh, they actually call it their throw in. Here is the free kick. We score on it, but if you watch, they call the, the ref actually says that one of our players fouled their player on the free kick, reverses it, no goal and now it's their free kick. And if you can watch this guy right there, he gets fouled, pushed. I very kind of, dis I don't know. We'll you, guys, you guys can decide in the comment section if you think that's a foul or not. Get the ball down the line. I just do a little bit of hesitation, push the ball out, get tripped up for the foul. Now we got a foul in their box close to, uh, close to uh, a good scoring opportunity here. And then on this uh, next play, it's cleared out from the same free kick. The ball rolls to me. I try to just hit it first time back in the box. Um, under hit it a little bit as they just clear it right back out of the 18. But it's better to do that than to lose it on one of those counterattack situations. And so on this one, uh, my coach wanted me up pressed high there. We went over video. He wants me high up on him. I saw this guy running in behind. It's just one of those things you have to decide if you're going to stay high in pressure or if you're going to go with the runner, but you can't be caught in between. So here, another tons of space. My forward is making a great run here. I just do quickly play him behind, run into it. Um, Should have cut in there, but a decent 1v1 attacking sequence right there. Get the ball wide again. I try to take a touch inside. I get some pressure, so I just play it back to my center back. Throwing the ball here into the forward, I'm taking it in, I play it back to my center mid, who then plays it right back out to me wide. I take a touch and then try to whip in a cross. Uh, decent, not not the best cross, not a bad cross, but uh, but yeah, I mean, got to the guy. Here's a long ball over top. I, ha I don't want to risk it heading it back to my, for uh, my keeper there, I just think it's a little risky, so I just play it, head it back over my head, try to do that wide, just because... In that situation, I didn't feel comfortable. Here, this was a bad play. My my coach wanted me to play down the line right here. He was open. I could have played to him. He could have crossed it. Instead, I do a bad cross, and then now it's could be a counterattack. But I get in front of the guy, hard hit, and he gets car called for the foul there. Just a tough, tough challenge. But yeah, I need to play with my right mid there. I can't do that cross. And see people are yelling at me right there. And I'm just like, yeah, my bad, my bad. My right mid plays me back the ball. I'm taking a touch in. I'm playing my center mid on his left foot so he can quickly turn right there and then play straight into our forward. That's crucial. And so many people are like, that's not like important to play the right foot. But yes, it is. Do a little move there, getting fouled. But I cross the ball in just a little bit over everybody's head. But a decent, decent chance there. Good ball wide. Lots of time, lots of space. So I'm taking up my space, taking my time. Still no pressure, but I just kind of dink in the ball up into my forward for him to hold up. And then uh, he's going to play me right back. Again, lots of time, so I'm going to just play right in the center, who uh, into my center mid. 
my right mid gets the ball, plays me back. Again, I got lots of time, so I played back to my center back. He has a guy pressuring him from the left side, plays me back. I have a cup, I have pressure. He's cutting off that center back, so I'm just going to take, take a touch up the field. And then again, just do a little ball straight into the forward. And our forward does a great job to hold the ball up there for us. Here's the uh, free kick again from Tavmo Guzman. He puts away his second one, and this time they do not reverse the call. So now we're up 1-0 uh, in the 72nd minute. Great free kick, especially from that angle on the corner of the 18 for him to hit that in the low post. That's a great free kick. Uh, you'll see a replay here soon, but yeah, it went up. There's Tavo Guzman. Hits it perfectly in that lower right corner or lower left corner of the goal. Great goal. So I get the ball wide. I play it wide into my forward. He does a good job, kind of gets, feels some contact and draws the foul. I take the touch in and get lots of pressure, so I'm going to play back to my left back for him to switch the ball. I'm going to get the ball with lots of time and space. I'm going to play it back to my right mid, so now I can get up the field in an advanced position, and now we're a lot more evenly spaced out. Tavo hits a good long ball up to the forward. It's I should have gone right, harder right into there. I should have, That should have been a hard tackle. I should have just kind of went in with lowered my shoulder, but I was soft, and then it kind of turned into a little fast break. Got the ball here. Tried to take him down the line. Um, decent. Our bench thought it was a foul. I don't really know. Could have been. Could have gone either way. Get the ball wide from my forward. Got some time and space. Do a little fake cross. Come down. Whip in the cross near post, but nobody's there for us. And I actually get stepped on hard by this big guy. And so I'm limping bad. I get the ball out wide now, and I try to play it. And no, I, I couldn't just handle it. Just it's nothing serious. And you guys will see. I'm the trainer's gonna come out, but just hard cleat right on the inside part of my uh, ankle. So and also I'm just kind of letting the time roll. We're up one zero. There's no need to uh, be too quick. You know, you gotta be a little cheeky sometimes. But that was definitely painful. Ball gets a long ball on the me. Head the ball out. Get the ball played back. And here I could play my center back, but being up one zero in the 81st minute. I'm just going to put it up for my forward. Forward has the ball. I'm getting out wide for him. Up in advanced position so now I can get the ball there. Some time. I am take the ball in. There's three guys here. There's not really any good passing lanes here or here. So I'm going to roll the ball back and just play it back to my center back. Center back is going to do a good ball entry ball into the forward. And the forward plays out to the right back. It plays it right back to me. This is great. We're possessing in their half now. At the end, drawing out the clock. Right mid plays me back the ball. I take a touch inside and play into the left foot of my center mid so we can quickly turn like that. A long ball over top. Again, so here I could play my center back or goalie, but again, it's now it's the 87th minute. We're up 1-0. I'm not taking any chances here, so I'm just going to clear the ball out, be smart, be safe, and then let them do a throw in. Get everybody back in that. Some time now, some space. I'm going to take it down the line, just play it right into my right mid. And we end up keeping the ball over there. Get the ball played back to me. I'm taking a touch in now and playing into my center mid. He's going to play it back to the center back. And that's the game. There's four minutes of extra time. Very tough game. Very hot human. But we got the 1-0 win against Charleston Battery, who were actually in the very first place of the conference. So great result for us. And here's a little bit of celebrating with the fans. Can't complain about that. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this, hit the thumbs up button like always. Subscribe if you're not subs subscribe. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And just uh, just keep up to date with all my new videos. All right, guys. I'll catch you in the next one.